Hello, just a quick video on how to speed up old championship managers and football managers. So these are the versions past CM3, so that's 98.99, up until like FM kind of around FM3, well pre-Steam version, so probably like FM10 up to about that, that kind of level, or that time, time of period. First off, what you need. You need something called Cheat Engine. The symbol needs to look like that on your desktop. There are different kind of files that are named that, but you need the specific one called Cheat Engine. So once it's installed, so you go through your new installation process, and once it's installed, it's down to you to download. I'm not telling you which sites are safe or not, because I don't even know myself. So I don't want people dropping me comments saying, oh, you use it at your own risk. Um, but I've never had any problems with it, and I, I used to do this with old PCs as well. One thing I will say though, if you if you use your do it on a computer you don't have Steam downloaded on, because they can actually block you from accessing games because of the anti-cheat policy on it. But it's not actually a cheat; all it does is speed hack the game. Obviously, there's options to like change game files and stuff with it, but that's for like more hackers and things. <laughs> so I don't get involved in that. Thing. I, all I'm literally doing is looking for it to increase the processing speed and how quickly the game clocks. So, but anyway, we're going to. So yeah, you, it's kind of something you want to use on a second computer. You may use for like old software and things like that. Obviously, you can use it if you don't use Steam. It's not going to make any difference. Um, but th that's the problem. I don't want people downloading it. They go and load a game and it says Steam. You can't access this game uh, online or whatever because you're using a you're using a cheat hack or something. So yeah, I'm just saying that in advance. Um, right, let's just load up Football Manager. I'm just going to show you how 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 I work here. It works for all games. So you just need to find what the process is called actually in Cheat Engine. But we'll load it up. It looks complicated, but it's not. So we're loading up Championship Manager 04. Let's just go into uh, load game, I guess. Where does where's that? Let's go play game, load game. Let's just load up one. I was actually going to start a Colombian game on it. Um, so what you need to do? So once the cheat engine's up, I'm using six point seven. And I think that's the one that's available to download. So then I'll go into. Sorry, you have to go to file, then you go to open process which is under the file here, so you go to open process. And as you can see here, it gives you all your files on your PC. So if you're running um, different games and stuff, it will speed up whatever you want, want to speed up. So obviously we want 0304, and I'm gonna go to open. So now the process is open. You need to click this, enable speed hack. And then it gives you a parameter of what speed you want to use it on. The reason why I like this so much, there's a lot of there's a lot of like set speed hacks you can download, but it's like if you use it once and then you exit the game and want to go back into the game, sometimes it, the, your system doesn't read it. But this the cheat engine it always reads it, and you can use it for all different processes. So let's just put the speed up to say 10. So we hit apply, and as you can see down the bottom there. So obviously you play matches, it's going to be 10 times quicker. And if you want to put it on 50, it can be 50 times. I don't really run it over 10 just in case it crashes. But I haven't had any, I haven't had one um, Championship Manager crash yet since I've been using it. And I've been using these hacks for years. But like I said before, just to keep it safe, just use it on the system. You're not bothered to run into the ground. Maybe an old one you use for old software. But yeah, just don't use it if you've got Steam in, installed. Um, so yeah, just use it for old FMs and CMs basically, or, or old games in generally. I don't know if there's like strategy games, you just want it to clock the processing quicker and things like that. So, but anyway, yeah. So, we're, and obviously if you just want to put it back on its normal speed, you just hit apply. But anyway, I just think it's an excellent tool because it works with, uh, I haven't loaded up a game, an old game and it hasn't worked on. So I just thought I'd let you know. Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.